hate to be the bearer of bad news, but I think your mother's gone walkabout again. I've just been to the flat and she's gone. She's upstairs. Uh, well, where are the kids? The girls are upstairs too. I've asked her to move back in. <laughs> what, last time wasn't disastrous enough? Yeah, I knew you wouldn't take it too well. Why have you asked her to move back in? What happened to putting Hope and Ruby first? I'll go. I don't want to be any trouble. She doesn't want to be any trouble. I've heard it all now. No, just leave it, will you? Well, why? Why have you asked her to move back in? And why have you changed your mind since this morning? Right, enough. You've had your rant. She's staying here and that's all there is to it. Right. So, go on. What have you said to him? Nothing. Nothing? You must have said something, eh? I would have got clean if it weren't for her. She's ruined my life. Is it something like that? Have you quite finished? No, I haven't quite finished. Not until you tell me what made you change your mind. It doesn't matter. Yeah, well, it what matters to me. I want to know what she said I've done. What terrible thing I did that ruined her whole life. I told her to take her elbows off the table. Yeah, I did that. Yeah, I told her to eat her greens because there were kids starving in the world. I washed her mouth out with soap because she called me a liar. Yeah, I did all that. So which of it is it? Come on, bring it, bring it on. Mm. Mm. Come on, nothing. Is it nothing? Ooh, I've never heard her so quiet in a long while. Well, I'll tell you. I'll tell you what it is. It's a lie. That's what it always is. Right, I'm going, and you have got about a week to make up your mind and come to your senses. Don't be too hard on her. You know what she's like. Oh, yeah, just a bit. I can always come back later if you've not finished talking about me. It's fine, it's fine. It's all right. I'm not going to have a Barney, OK? Oh, really? Cos I cannot understand how you can turn your back on your own daughter. Oh. What, so do you think I was holed up in that flat with her for weeks because I'm addicted to daytime television or what? No, I was trying to get her to be clean. Fat lot of good it did. Oh, so what, you're just going to give up on her again? She shouldn't be here. There's kids in the house. Take that as a yeah, then. I'm too tired to keep on doing this. I'm going to sort myself out. Yeah, yeah, when Nelson gets his eye back, you will. Do you know, it must be marvellous to be right all the time. Yes, well, I would love you to prove me wrong, Cassie. But somehow, I don't think you're going to do it by overdosing in front of your own grandchildren. Right, enough. Why are you all shouting? Oh, sorry, love. Girls, everything's fine. Why don't you go back upstairs, eh? Yeah, maybe I should just go. You know, we're never going to see eye to eye on this, are we? I mean, let's face it. So, yeah, maybe I should just go back to the flat for a bit. Hmm? Yeah. Yeah, maybe I think that'll be for the best. Well, I'll go and pack my things. <laughs>